What's going on guys? We are back with some more Vigor and today we're actually going to be talking about the Ogpara. Now this is going to be a full video. This is just going to be surrounding the Ogpara because it's it's got to be the best gun in the game right now at the current build because pre-patch this thing was terrible. This thing just with its variants alone is better than the P90 in my opinion. It's got no recoil. Now, pre-patch, I don't know if you actually use this, but for the people that did use it, it was so bad. Oh, we've got somebody over here shooting at me already. All right, so this guy, this guy is low right now. Oh man, you guys are witnessing some of the best aim I guarantee you this guy's in the tree line, prone somewhere. No, but for the people that do have this unlocked currently right now, I suggest you pull them out and you use them now before they get nerfed, because I guarantee you this is gonna get nerfed to the ground like the Sumi did. I mean, the Sumi's still like semi good, but it's not what it once was. I'm trying to spook him out right now, but you know, wait a minute, what if he's actually in the shed? All right, so it's empty. I would get that box, but right now I'm mainly just focused on getting kills. He's still in there somewhere. He's gotta be, unless he went around. I wonder if he's up here. Right in front of me. Here we go. What is he doing? Where did he go, actually? He's in the trees again. Let's go. I wonder if, this, I wonder if he's got meds. Because I hit him before. I guarantee he's got meds. Alright, so we got him. We got somebody else? What was that guy doing? Who knows? We'll go see what that guy had for loot here in a minute. Oh, so he just had a pistol. So I'm hunting down dudes with pistols. That's no good. Let's see what this guy had. Is this guy a bird hunter up here? Yep, big game bird hunter. All right, so now we got a secondary if we need to use it. I doubt it though. So what I'm thinking is, is that we're gonna push in into town here, see about using the signal detector or whatever's in town. We'll put these guns away because then I can actually run faster. I hear fighting in the distance. Now I'm assuming that's by the points of interest in town but you'd think if there was more players like next to me actually in my area they'd go towards the shots like I'm doing right now but I forget that not everyone plays nearly as aggressive as I do but it is what it is yep so somebody's at the signal detector we're gonna head up the street here and we'll check it out All right, so I just heard somebody shoot. So at least we know they're still in the lobby and they haven't left yet, because I'm so used to getting in lobbies and just everyone loose up and they're like, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna head out. And it's like, I'm trying to shoot people. All right, so if there is guys, they should be right up here by this signal detector. 
I've not seen anybody yet. This guy's trying to use this uh this semi right here as cover. It's not happening though, bud. Yep, he's right there. He's at the front of it. We're gonna try to keep a distance. All right, so one more kill and we get marked. I'm not seeing anybody else. Oh, all right, so now we got another guy. Sounds like this guy is an RPK. We're gonna keep our distance at him. We'll see if this guy just keeps on dumping rounds. Because I do not think he can shoot through this. <laughs> None of those bullets hit. Amazing. Alright, keep dumping rounds, buddy. There we go. Alright. So we're going to pick up his gun. But I'm going to wait till it's safe. Because there might be more guys right next to this area. I don't want them all to rush me as I'm looting his body. I think I'm going to go for it. Switch. Okay, we'll get that. reload this so straight off the bat I do not like this guy's camo because this thing is too bright like if I'm prone anywhere like in any grass anything any brush doesn't matter what it is somebody can see me from a mile away because I stick out like a sore thumb so that's my tip of the day for you guys do not equip pink and purple all these bright ass camos because if you actually don't want anybody to see you you probably shouldn't well i want this guy to push in we'll see where he's at but i've fought people with crazy ass camos and they're sitting in a bush or they're sitting in some type of grass area and i can see you this guy doesn't think i see him well now he knows but guy gonna push in or what all right so we'll get this guy's uh we'll get his uh meds and some of his uh loot here so we're gonna push in towards this uh airdrop now that's coming down so hopefully that should uh attract the rest of the players in the lobby we're gonna hit this uh signal detector again though so we gotta wait for it to warm back up okay so that's gonna be down right there so that's gonna be easy what's probably gonna end up happening is somebody's just gonna rush it and decide oh no one else has got the drop for the past 30 seconds that it's been down I guess that means it's mine, right? So that's what every no skin does in the game. They're just like, oh, well, I'm gonna rush it. I'm gonna get my uh, common crates and I'm gonna dip. All right, so there's one other guy in the lobby. I'm gonna outweigh him now. It's a common drop. So either way, it's not the end of the world, but I guarantee you the other person does not have enough patience for this common drop that I do. So we're just gonna look at it from a distance. And uh, he's over there somewhere. He's probably just, uh, he might be looking at it too. That could be the case. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Now, unfortunately the live audio cut out and the last two minutes to this video of me camping the drop got uh, deleted somehow so I don't know what happened but what happened in the lobby was I ended up getting the crate and running to the nearest exit 
and killing the guy. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching the video and I'll see you on the next episode.